Hello and welcome to this video on how to position your NX wind transducer and your WSI box as part of your NX system. Uh, we're going to talk about how to position the wind transducer on our mast and how to actually get the WSI box in the best position as possible to get the best signal possible. Before that, I just want to quickly talk about our wind transducer bracket. You simply need three screws to hold it onto the mast and there's actually no tooling required to actually fasten the wind transducer to the bracket. To simply fasten the uh, wind transducer in, it fits in the slot there. We simply tighten the nut and then hold the nut in place by the locking mechanism here. So we've positioned our wind transducer over the centre line of our boat, it's forward facing. Our next job is to think about how we're going to position the WSI box, the wireless signal interface. This is the heart of the system, of an NX system. Uh, its main job is to receive the radio signals from the wind transducer. And just like any other radio, it can, its signals can be disturbed by other appliances in the vicinity. For example, loudspeakers or a motor. So the question is, how do we get the best signal strength between the wind transducer and the WSI box? Well, thankfully, on the instruments, we have a value called the RSI value radio strength indicator and this is simply a value of how strong the radio signal is between the wind transducer and the WSI box and as you can see what we can do and this is a good tip for you to actually do in the boat is just to connect the system as we have done here loosely without screwing the WSI box uh, into its permanent position and you can move the box around and see where the best signal for is in your boat Obviously you're going to have constraints in your actual boat itself, but as we see here we've got a signal up in the 50s, that's perfect. It should be over 20 at the very least. But just by moving it around in the constraints of your boat, you will see where the best position is. So, I hope that's made everything clear for you, and I hope you get a good signal between your WSI box and your wind transducer. If you do need any help, please just call us at support, or even drop us an email at support at nexusmarine.se. Thank you.